Yo guys, what's up? I'm Justin from OV Baseball Blogs. Guys, my throat is feeling a little bit weird today, but I'm going to read you a blog I wrote on my website, French MLB Franchise Insider.wordpress.com, about this potential trade that could be going down between the Texas Rangers and the Pittsburgh Pirates. Um, the deal is to be sending, the Pirates are going to be sending Joel Hanoran um, to the Texas Rangers for, I bet, uh, about a couple minor league prospects or something that's going to be going on. So I'm going to read you off the blog right now. My throat hurts like crap right now, guys, so I apologize. But I'm going to read you off the blog I wrote since it's like a small blog I wrote about this. So here is here is what I wrote. The Fox Sports reporter Ken Rosenthal has announced that the Texas Rangers are currently seeking some bullpen aid. Rosenthal, Rosenthal announced that, that the Texas Rangers are currently eyeing Joel Hanneran, uh, the closer of the Pittsburgh Pirates. Joel is having a great season so far. He is in fourth place for most saves this season. At 13 saves, he has appeared in all 13 save opportunities and, now, and has not blown one save so far this season. Joel has appeared in 21 games so far this season for the Pir for the Pittsburgh Pirates and has been pitching great. He has an ERA at 1.66. He currently has 16 strikeouts for the season. The Pirates said that if they were to trade Joel to the Texas Rangers, they would want a reasonable price in return for the 29-year-old lefty who is in who is under contract with the Pirates until 2013. If Joel is to be traded to the Texas Rangers, it would be as a setup role for the for the now closer Natali Feliz. Or next season, if Natali Feliz is moved to the pitching rotation, you can see Joel Hanneran as a permanent closer for the Texas Rangers. So, if you guys watch the Texas Rangers, if you guys are huge fans of the Texas Rangers, you will look at their bullpen and man, it's there's three guys out of the six or seven of them that are old. Okay, so you got Arthur Rhodes, Darren Oliver, and Dave Bush. Those guys are out of their prime right now. Arthur Rhodes, I'm pretty sure he's going he's going to retire. Maybe he probably has a year left, or maybe he's considering retiring after this season. Darren Oliver, he he had his time with the LA Angels. I think that was his prime years with LA. I think that adding Joel Hanneran to this pitching rotate to the bullpen at least will be terrific because if Natalie Felice is to be in the rotation, I mean, look at this rotation. C.J. Wilson, Colby Lewis, Matt Harrison, Ogando, who's just been having a great season so far, Derek Holland, Tommy Hunter. That, and just adding Feliz in there, he could possibly be maybe a number two or a number three guy and possibly putting Colby Lewis or maybe Tommy Hunter at four and five. So... I could see this as one of the one of, a good trade. So on both ends, I would have to say for Pittsburgh, I could possibly probably be asking. I don't maybe a couple prospects. I know Michael Young says he doesn't want he didn't want to be a Texas Ranger at the start of the season because he's not going to get the third base, the starting as a, as a starting third baseman because Adrian Beltre is here. So Michael Young has since then been saying I'm fine. I'm gonna be fine here in Texas. Um, Many teams were actually asking for Michael Young, but I could possibly be seeing either Michael Young possibly going to the Pirates. I could possibly not. It could possibly be a, a, a nice package of prospects, I think, going Pittsburgh's way. But we just have to see. It could be possibly going down the trade deadline, or it could be a little bit early. So it will all be a matter of time until we see Joel Hanneran as, a, as possibly the closer or setup role man for the Texas Rangers. So guys, thank you so much for tuning in. I'm Justin from Baseball Blogs. I'll talk to you guys later.